exploding action buttons, or FABs, represent a primary action in an application. Floating action buttons in Ionic are broken up into three separate components. The first one being Ion Fab Button. Fab button can take any child content, be it icon or text, and renders a circular button to the screen. Ion Fab button is not set to one particular area, so if we have a list of scrollable items and we try to scroll the content, we'll see the fab button move away. To fix this, we can wrap the fab button inside an ion fab and then set the slot attribute to place the fab in the ion contents fixed slot position. Now, when we scroll the content, the fab stays in its position while the rest of the content scrolls underneath it. To change where the ion fab is positioned vertically, we can set the vertical attribute and pass in a value of top, center, or bottom. A value of top will keep the fab towards the top of the ion content. A value of center will place the fab in the middle of the screen. And a value of bottom We'll place the fab at the bottom of the ion content. We can also change the horizontal position of the ion fab by setting the horizontal attribute. If we set the horizontal attribute to be a value of start, the fab will be placed on the left side of the screen in left to right and on the right side of the screen in right to left. If we change the horizontal attribute to place the item on the end, the ion fab will be placed on the right side of the screen in left to right, and on the left side of the screen in right to left. And if we change the horizontal's position to be center, the ion fab will be placed in the center of the ion content. If we want to create a nested list of fab buttons inside our ion fab, we can do that with the ion fab list component. The ion fab list component takes a array of different ion fab buttons and then also accepts a side attribute to set where the fab list should be rendered. The side attribute can have a value of top which will render the fab button list to the top of the ion fab. An important thing to note is that the icon in the main ion fab button will automatically have its content switched out to be a close icon, and the click handler on the ion fab itself will automatically wire up to show the ion fab list and animate the elements in. Other valid values for the side attribute are start, end, and bottom. With the fab list open, when we click one of the buttons, we'll automatically close the fab list and then animate the icon away and restore the original text. 